Our story begins in Ontario, Canada. Imagine, you're an office worker and 9 to 5 is the name of the game. On average, you will spend almost half of your life here. So, if you're 1.6 million single parents who are the sole provider for their family, or one of the 4 million Canadians taking care of their ill and elderly parents, the way you live here determines the way you live everywhere. So say your work starts to pile up. Your counterpart is on leave and you need to oversee their tasks. A new project gets underway and suddenly, your parent, your family member, your loved one is unwell. This means hospitalizations, checkups, emergency calls. How do you do it all? More importantly, how does your employer accommodate and support you? Canadians identify the workplace as the number one contributing factor to their mental health. But in the past decade alone, we experienced a 10% drop in work-life satisfaction. Due to our aging national population, more candidates than ever are taking on the role of caretaker in addition to their regular profession. So when the demands of workplace are too much, we shall go to give those without the care they need. The work-life imbalance which results cost Canada $10 billion annually in absenteeism, lost productivity, and missed deadlines. More importantly, it costs Canadians their well-being. This is Anne. Anne is the mother of three kids and has been with the company for 15 years. Anne's husband has been sick for 10 years and recently underwent a major heart surgery. Anne is overwhelmed as a primary financial supporter of her family and must take time off to be with her husband during recovery. She doesn't want to leave her job but needs the employer's assistant to get through the difficult time. It's frustrating when we are told to attend a mandatory workshop about work-life balance and we go and listen to somebody lecture about it for a couple of hours or whatever. You sit there and you listen but you don't follow through. We need action. Introducing imbalance a certification and consulting solution for work-life balance in the Ontario office. In partnership with the Canadian Mental Health Association and the Ontario Professional Government, a certification program employs mental health professionals to measure the accommodation efforts an employer on a scope from poor to exceptional. Once areas for improvement are identified, Imbalance then collaborates and employers implement content-specific solutions. Ontario residents like Anne need contextual solutions not only as employees but as individuals and as caretakers. This is where Imbalance comes in. Step 1. An Imbalance expert enters the office and begins the certification process by interviewing management and gaining perspective on workplace culture. Step 2. Over the period of a few weeks, the Imbalance expert observes the workplace to better understand employees' needs and dynamics. Step 3. Imbalance experts speak directly with employees to better understand which challenges impact their work-life balance. Being a third-party group of trained mental health professionals, Imbalance experts ensure that employees are comfortable sharing their input honestly. Step 4. Imbalance experts grant a certification based on the achievements of the workplace and accommodating work-life balance. The first of its kind in Ontario to recognize employers that prioritize mental health. Step 5. Based on feedback given by employees, the Imbalance expert makes recommendations for the workplace to address areas for improvement. Step 6. With the guidance of imbalance experts, employers implement these changes and monitor success over time with metrics such as employee satisfaction, retention, and productivity. Whereas other solutions are limited in scope, ineffective, and cookie cutter, Imbalance creates holistic and contextual solutions for Canadian employees, complete with follow-up and monitoring programs to assess results, delivered by professionals for professionals. After all, a supportive workplace is a better workplace, and it starts right here in Ontario. We begin with the average 9-to-5 office space, generating demand by targeting leaders in the field as early adopters, and building relationships with partners in mental health and workplace improvement to penetrate Ontario office workforces. The value proposition? Improved workplace culture, employee satisfaction, productivity, and retention. Over time, we can adapt and apply this model in provinces and territories across Canada with the support of provincial governments along the way, eventually expanding our approach to meet the work-life demands of Canadians within and beyond the office. Services delivered by Imbalance are business to business, meaning what is accomplished in the workplace is paid by the workplace, and precedence has shown this model works. Employers already endeavor to better their workplace culture, retention, and productivity via workshops, initiatives, and more. Impounds helps to streamline and expedite this process, saving adopters money so that they don't have to reinvent the wheel. In this way, employers can make sure their staff have all that they need to achieve work-life balance, while also attracting top talent from potential employees. 
Imbalance is partnering with CMHA, and we hope you do the same with you, our Ontario provincial government. Your recent commitment to mental health inspired us. The $17 billion that Ontario will commit to mental health and addiction services over the next four years will touch the lives of countless Canadians. Today we implore that you help us help you. With government grant funding, we can incentivize uptake in early adopters. We are in balance, and we are creating a more accommodating Canada. Life is better in balance.